Hello viewers and welcome to the commissioning of the Izog Bodo Rumapo in Rupoku area here in Portacourt River State. And of course it's another beautiful day for some commissioning duties by the River State Governor, His Excellency Nyesom Ezemwo Wike, whom yesterday of course uh, was at the, the commissioning of um, the Police Intelligence and Surveillance Building. It was a pleasant sight to behold and uh, yet again he is supposed to be expected to be here for another commissioning duty so while we are waiting of course a lot of things are going down here at this uh, location so i would say you are very much welcome to join me as we take a look around and of course bring to your screen some interesting footages and clips of the event happening here so stick with us don't go anywhere <laughs> He said when we are doing flagging off and the time Tana Road, that the leader would seem to talk to me over SARS and the sports going to Republic. That was not correct. The chairman, he never spoke to me one day about the road. I know Republic more than you very well. I'm from Apra Kingdom. I was chairman of this local government. So there's no way you will plead. He didn't plead with me. So don't be telling people. I am the one who be there with you. So don't use me to do for one hour. <laughs> Let me tell you about this road. Actually, I didn't know about this road, this one. But when you are coming for Roma, going to Nega, before most of you must have forgotten that we did that road. You are forgetting from Rumapu to Eneka. And from Rumundu down to Eneka, we did the, the two roads. Now, this one is what they call Tender Driven Road. It was up mass. How they go and identify roads that are not good, I do not know. He came to me, and that on this road, in fact, it says Rupaku to the greeter. I looked at it. I said, I'm not tired. I'm giving you one or two jobs. Leave this one. I cannot finish everything. When another person comes, let the person come and do so. This so, will so, be bad. Having done Rumapu to Eneka. So I said, okay, let's see. I wanted to walk. I was awarded the road. So I want to thank the contractor inside, who is the vendor. This is what they call vendor-driven project. 
So I don't define this particular role. A highly populated area. I want to thank you, even though you have made your own profit. But I want to sincerely thank you for your sincerity, for the love you have for the people living along this area. My dear good people of Oboku, in fact, Oboku as a whole, today we have started doing an again Tanaro phase two, an again Tanaro phase uh, one, and again to Iboche. So we have done this one, we have built this house going straight to an Obodu. Remember, from a Ledo, down to the Obodu, down to uh, Obrikoni Road, I was the one who did it. I hope you remember. I hope you remember. So, I'm not, I'm not done Kuma Put and the Karoli. Isn't that correct? Isn't that correct? I've not done Kuma Put and the Karoli. Isn't that correct? Isn't that correct? I've not done Kuma Put and the Karoli. Isn't that correct? So, you are the one who is not, is it not? Is it not? Yeah. I know the ones who are in us. Yeah. Now, what I want to tell you, you see, this thing is like Abu Mbweta, Abla, Imenum, Meni, Abla. Now that we have done it for you, you did first for us. I will retaliate by doing for you. Now we have come to ask you again to go and do for us. If you do for us, it means we also do for you again. Will you do for us? Will you do for us? Yes. You know what I mean? Yes. You know what I mean? Yes. You know what I mean? Yes. You vote for our governor? Yes. Will you vote for our governor? Yes. Will you vote for a senatorial candidate? Yes. Will you vote for a House of Rights candidate? Yes. Will you vote for assembly candidate? Yes. Then there are one, I'll come and tell you where we vote. Yes. So all I will tell you, I'm back down, I'm back down, all I will tell you, don't worry, come down, this was I mentioned now, make sure you come and vote for them. Very soon, we will meet in our houses and take a decision where we are going to. We are still talking. And I'm going to go. 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 i There was nowhere I have awarded Ruby Bow in Tana Road. So I don't know where anybody would have said Napa. Is there anywhere Napa that say I have not told them? Can anybody in any community in Napa raise their hand now and say, Look, you have not touched us? If you don't say it now, don't say it again. Say it today, today. But as well in Napa, I have not remembered. So, I have passed. Not so. I have passed. The only thing remaining is the chief, the premier, second class, third class. All right. 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 So, Senator John, I talk about this every day. If I ask him, I was going to say, you know what?
happy with what we are doing. We are happy with the support our people are giving to us. It makes me, as I wake up every day, I feel so proud that when I'm going home, I'm going to show that high yes. that I have not disappointed our people. The promises I made to our people, I have fulfilled those uh, oh. promises. And I can assure you, because the government is coming with his team, will also not disappoint you. Don't allow these people who say they are in the election, they are not in the election. They are body body die. They are not running the election. They are also looking for where they will say, oh, we are that You know there is no way you can win the mass state. And then you are just making noise for, to go and collect money from people. At the end of the day, you say you are in that. Who are we following you for you to win the election? Which local government will you win? Let us take local government by local government. Who are those there that will make you to win the election? There are opinion leaders, the influencers of people, no matter how you like it. Take, for example, today, if you go to Enega, who follow you in Enega? General Bada is not with, it's not with you. Other people are not with you. How do you win Enega? If you come to Rupak, you don't see Beira, you don't see Brooklyn, you don't see all the other people. How do you win Rupak? I don't want to talk about my program. It's a no-go. So how do you win? I don't know. Just because you must vote for a party that has come to your aid, a party that has brought dividends of uh, democracy. If the people of Oboku are not happy, would they be here? No. Would they be here? No. All of our governance is happiness of the people. When the people are happy, we are happy. So if I come here to address you, everybody will listen to me. But if I was governor and I've not done anything, can I come here and campaign? No. Some people say, oh, they were governor for eight years, they didn't do anything. They now are coming to tell you, don't worry, when the war comes. You don't care, what happened? I'm almost saying eight years, I didn't do anything. They are coming to campaign to you to say, look, vote for this person, you will do. You, you were there, you didn't do. It's the one that you are bringing that will uh, do. Would you believe that? No way. So we have done our own part. And that is why there is peace in our state. Yesterday, the Expedition Police came, we commissioned the Intelligence and Surveillance Center to tell all of you who may have man of sin doing kidnapping, the time is over. Because as it is now, the uh, intelligence center will be watching your screen anywhere you want the road will see you. So that period is over where you think you will do something, you run away. I'm telling you in case you are here, because I'm not sure everybody that is here are all good people. There must be some bad uh, So please, this is what I owe you to tell you. If you have succeeded yesterday, it does not mean you will succeed today. If you succeed today, it does not mean you succeed uh, tomorrow. We have equipment now that even if you are on the road, we will see you. That's what we have spent the money for. We have spent money to protect our citizens. We cannot allow this kidnapping here and there. We cannot allow these armed robbers operating here and there. We must protect lives so that business can thrive and people can get jobs. And business will move on, and then the government will be able to collect their taxes and do more roads. If they are not able to pay taxes, we cannot have money to do uh, roads. So, all of you are happy. I've seen the picture of here, how here was. If you are doing business and you are living here, carry the picture, go and put it in front of your house. So, as you wake up, you see the state of the road before, and now you see the state of the road. It will make you to say, Oh God, this is the government will believe in. This is the party at the state level. This is what I said. Party at the state uh, level. At the state level, this party is doing very, very well. And you must continue with us. I'm speaking on the national television. I'm not talking here. I want anybody who's anywhere to hear me. No, no. They cannot do me anything. Yes. No, 
don't have it. Yes, they don't have the capacity to drive. So, here in our state, everybody that's from that generation will wish you good luck. Carry. Go. Rivers will say carry. Go. Papa will say carry. Go. Papa will say carry. Go. You know, it's over. And I thank you. On that basis, let me call our leaders to join us and commission this very important road. God bless you. The, the Rumapu Road. Yeah, you can, you can see for yourself, you can see how densely populated the area is and you better appreciate the project mm. if you know what it was before now. Uh, it was uh, in a pejorative state. Uh, today it has been fixed. We have um, a total of uh, 7.6 kilometer drain mm. and over 50,000 square meters of asphaltic uh, concrete pavement I can see here. And uh, this can only be done by a very responsive uh, government uh, like that led by Governor Yosom Wiki. Uh, we, come, we started this project about a year ago. Today we are here for the commissioning and uh, we are happy about it. This project cuts, about, uh, cuts across about four communities. Rukboku, Izo, Ogbodo, and then uh, Rumwapo, even up to Igrita. So that's what it is. You can see it already. It's okay. very impactful. It's very right. impactful. The, okay. The, the impact cannot be overemphasized. You can see it's all built up. The value of properties will come up, commercial activities will be boosted up and all of that. Mm. Logistics will be made easier. Traveling time will be reduced. Well, it's a good thing. We thank the governor for remembering this road because people living around this vicinity has been suffering before this time. But I believe today the struggle of looking for shortcuts and all the rest in order for them to go to their house has ended. It's a good one. We say thank you to the governor of River State. He has done well in Rokoko and River State at large. All right. Well, the project is a laudable one. Okay. And I must first of all congratulate His Excellency Chief Barrister Ezebu Mwonye Sumwike. And I will also congratulate the Executive Chairman of Obiakwa Local Government Area, who is Honorable Barrister Ariolu, for this project. This project, as I said, is a laudable one. If you come to this road before now, you can't access the road. Mm. The road is, in fact, the, the way the road is, it is, not some, it is nothing to write home about. And today, when I got to this place, I saw that the road is beautiful. Driving from here, I think the road led to Bolingo area. Driving from here to that area, one could just close his eyes and, and drive. So I want to say that this project is a good one. Okay. And it will actually benefit people on this road, people that live here, even people that live far there in Igruta. The okay. Because if there is traffic, it's an access road where you can go to wherever you're, you're going around this vicinity. Right. I want to say that the project is a good one and it's, and it's beneficial to people that stay around and people that doesn't stay around, that stay even in the neighboring community. Okay. The project was so fantastic. We are happy. At least have, we have been waiting to see our governor. Yes, so we can. Today we have seen him live and the project is very nice. The road he worked for us. We, we indeed we appreciate him. He tried for us, especially Romapo All right. community. Uh, we are very very happy, and we appreciate the governor for the good works he has been doing in the, in the River State, in large, right, such as this community. He has saved the life of many people. At least when they pass through this place, there will be no more hold up. There will be no more traffic. Yes. The road is very, very good for them now to be moving through. So how do you rate the government of Governor Wiki so far? 10 over 10. 10 over 10? Yeah. So far, I rate him 100%. He's one of the best uh, governor that the nation has ever produced. I'm giving him the whole 10. Wow. Yeah, Wonderful. because he, he has tried. Okay. Following his commissioning, the things he has done. In fact, I keep following the commissioning everywhere they go. Okay. There's no governor in Nigeria that has done what Wiki has done. 10%. Okay. 10%. He's a good man. Okay. 
Okay. The project, a, a promise keeper. Okay. All whatever he has promised River State, he has been doing it. Okay. And I've been praying for him. Okay. At least maybe I know okay. he will reach there, okay, so which is president. Okay, viewers, we have uh, come to the end of another day of commissioning here in River State. Um, I had an amazing time. I hope you did too. I hope you enjoyed those wonderful footages and clips that came your way. My name is Cyril Aloysius reporting to you from TAF TV. Come your way again next time. Please endeavor to um, make sure that you subscribe to this channel. See you some other time and bye for now.